What will be the most important thing in the world in the next three to four years? It's not AI itself. It's not robots. It's not self-driving cars. The real answer is space data centers. Sounds crazy, right? But if we go back to first principles, we'll realize something shocking building data centers on Earth was a mistake from the very beginning. Let's break it down. A data center has two core costs, electricity and cooling. First, electricity. In space, satellites get 24 hours of nonstop sunlight. No, night, no, clouds, no. Weather, sunlight in orbit is 30% stronger, and the total usable energy is six times higher than on Earth. What does that mean? It means you don't need massive, expensive batteries. The cheapest and most abundant energy in the entire solar system is solar power in space. Now let's talk cooling. On Earth, Almost half of a data center's weight and cost goes into cooling systems, air conditioners, water pipes, chillers, you name it. Heat is the enemy. Cooling is the battle. But in space, cooling is free. Just put a radiator on the side of the satellite that faces away from the Sunday. The temperature there is close to absolute zero. All the complicated cooling equipment, all the huge costs instantly disappear. But here's the part people don't see coming inside a terrestrial data center. Racks communicate through fiber optics, laser signals running inside a cable. But what's faster than that? A laser traveling through vacuum, when thousands of satellite data centers link up with laser beams. In space, you get a super network faster than anything that exists on Earth. So what does this mean for normal people? Right now, when I send a command from my phone, the signal travels to a base station, enters fiber cables, passes through several routers, reaches a data center then returns the same way, slow, messy, inefficient. But in the future, your phone talks directly to a satellite. The signal goes up, gets processed, and comes down. Done. Lower cost, higher speed. A computing world that finally feels like the AI future we imagine. Space data centers aren't science fiction. They're the next big leap and they're coming much faster than most people think.